applying a crease to a mesh model. When we apply a crease to a mesh model, it is like sharpening the edge or folding the edge of a paper. When we go to add smoothness to it, or we add a smooth level of one or higher, those creases will not be smooth. They'll be squared off. So, for example, this is my button. I want my button to remain rectangular in shape. So, I will actually uh, apply a crease to that area. So, we go up to our mesh. We go to add crease. And in the add crease, I can either A, select um, an edge or a face. Uh, in this case, I'm going to select a face uh, to grab and it found that whole face and I said enter and it says specify crease value and I always will say um, uh, and I'll say enter at this point and uh, now let's go and do one more um, let's go down and do the front of this lens let's add a crease and down here I can say let's go and say let's turn on just my edges and I'm gonna pick on uh, on an edge here and hold my control key down I'm gonna go around picking various edges and I'm gonna get just these edges holding my control key down I got them all I hit enter and I'm going to say enter for always. And now I put creases on those areas. Now let's go and do a smooth more. I pick on my object, I hit enter, and you can see how it smooths uh, those areas except for where I picked uh, along those edges. Uh, it's got a nice flat surface on the top. It didn't round that button off. Let's say do smooth more again, and you can see how my button is square on the top. Okay, and uh, same thing in the front. So you, you know I'm kind of molding my my camera body now. So it just provides in line in which that area does not get it gets squared off. It doesn't get rounded around this corner right here. Yeah, I got rounded around the edge, but it was just this edge. If I wanted to remain the whole rectangular button, I would have squared off all four sides of it and the top. And then that way it would have remained rectangular, but the top is nice and flat now, and uh, I can keep that flat surface. So I created a crease to make that surface flat after I added smooth more as an option. So I want to do the creases before I do a smooth more. Okay, so adding a crease uh, is like putting a crease in the fold paper, and it when we go to apply our smoothing, uh, those creases then are there and provide a flat surface uh, that do not get rounded.